guys, this is track 13E. 13E. It's 96.6 acres for 139.9. Talk about a hunt track now. This place has got tons and tons of areas that you need to be on right now getting your food plots together, getting set up for hunting season. It is absolutely covered up with deer and turkey. a hunting track. It could be a recreational track. It could be a home track. There's a uh, it does abut the county road, Blacktop Road. City water electric phone cable internet is there at the road. So it does abut that road and you can build a house in there. There was uh, already an old house there that's been poured down years ago. We're going to go down and have a look at it. Plenty of flat area right there to build on. like I'm riding forever, but 99 acres is a big piece of property. This is another little area right here that would be a great little spot for food plots. And the odd thing is, I don't know if you can see this, this little spot right know you know especially if uh, you're looking for a hunt track property
about trails. Again, we are still on that 99 acres. I'm just going to get down here just a little piece more. take that side road down there's another place already cleaned up that I want to show you again great little spot for a food plot there's a road going down right there and guys if you if you're looking for a clean place to bring your kids your grandkids you know, you don't want to drive by five miles of trailers and junky houses, junkyards. This is it. Almost everything around here is big, beautiful farms, agriculture. Growing up as a kid, I didn't think much of it, uh, but now, looking back, I guess I was pretty lucky to grow up in this. Playing in the woods and the creeks. Way 
back then, you know, Mama used to have to whip us to get us to come in the house. Nowadays, you got to whip them to get them out of the house. See, there's another little spot here already cleaned up. We just cleaned this up. You can get up to this property from right there. Now, there's a better way. I'm going to take you down the better way. But keep in mind, either way, you are going to have to have some type of side-by-side -side or four-wheeler until you straighten it out. And if Christ is selling it, you should be able to take a little money and straighten this out just a little bit. Some people get scared going down this thing. original trail going up right there so honestly I'm not sure which way is better and a side by side or a four wheeler neither one of them is going to be a big deal for you and this area right down here is where you would build sit right here there's the uh, county road utilities are right there the old house used to sit right there where the side-by-side -side is and there's no storm shelter slash potato cellar right back in here they actually built it into the side of the hill and I think that was just an old storage shed right there. Now, well, there's deer print. I don't know if you can see that. There's deer print right there. It's a good little piece of property. There's no spring box back in behind here. And this is just the seasonal spring. The water comes down here when it's wet. Uh, there's the old spring box. I don't know if you could sing that back in there. But there's your build site right there where the side-by-side -side is. And again, the blacktop road 
is right there and you've got the mountains right across the street from you this is track 13 e and if you're interested i'd love to bring you here and show you this beautiful piece of property right there and I, I don't know this for sure but right there it almost looks like there's an old well right there but now I don't know that for sure uh, so I'm saying that don't count that there is a well there uh, I mean not that you need it there's city water and everything's right there at the road uh, but yeah if you want to see it please give me a holler thanks